Good morning. Welcome to our Croatian homestead. My name is Marin and we are on four and a half acres of raw land which we are trying to turn into our working homestead. I have finally found some bricklayers that, that are happy to come and um, brick my home. Now today is quite wet, the, it rained this morning. I was meant to draw up all the columns and drill the Rio by and camp set it into the into the slab for them just to come and start breaking but the rain is the rain messed me up so hopefully by this afternoon it will be a little bit dry and i've got a whole day tomorrow maybe to do this uh, good thing about about everything is that uh, it is time to pick grapes so everyone is really busy picking grapes so i've got I've got a few days up my sleeve before the guys are finished with grape picking. Don't really have to hurry up, but I'm excited to get it wow. out. Everything is wet. I can go into that uh, chicken brooder and get that painted. No need to wait around for <laughs> my concrete to dry, for my concrete to dry and do nothing, right? So let's get that done. We've picked the first Adrian's giant pumpkin. Well, there's another one sitting in there. We'll probably do that one tomorrow. But I've got to find space to, to store it nicely because we are not going to eat it straight away. Finally, this room has uh, come to a point where it's going to get painted and looking good again. So, ready now, I can start. Regarding the painting, I am the, I'm just, I have two left hands, um, but the new baby chicks won't mind. The main thing is everything is clean and sanitary for them. I'm actually putting quite a bit of paint to seep into all the pores, so it just seals everything. But yeah, as you can see, I've done like two square meters and there's more paint on, on me and on the floor than on the walls, but hey. We can't be good at all the jobs, we can't love all the jobs. The main thing is uh, we give it a go. Finally, I'm getting to the point where I can paint this. There was a lot of other chores that were more important, but now I'm happy that I'm doing this. Uh, 
Um, this wall has taken the whole bucket and behind the door I haven't finished yet. Um, it's mu much rougher than the wall that I painted over there with one bucket. And I managed to put two coats on it and the ceiling. But lucky I have another bucket so I'll try to finish that and hopefully I can finish the ceiling. And then if I run out of paint I'll go, have to go and buy another bucket for that. For that corner over there. I mean, <laughs> I'm not good at painting and well, I guess I'm not getting a break from it. It will have to wait for another day to get finished. I have finished, God knows when was this painted. I've got a little bit more than a third left of this bucket. So what I'll do is I'll wait for this to dry a little bit and give it another coat. Uh, the corner there will have to wait for me to buy another bucket. Uh, but at least we are going somewhere. It's, it's looking much, much better now. I'll have a quick break and then I'll come back and do the second coat and hopefully there will be enough. Well, if it's not, when I buy the new one, I can finish it. I'm actually thinking to paint the whole floor as well, just to sanitize it. I don't know. What do you guys think? Whether it's a good idea to do the floor as well or not? Please let me know. I have used the second, the whole bucket and I only managed to put a second coat on the walls. Ceiling didn't get the second coat. So I'm guessing I'll go buy another two buckets when I go to the shops and buy something else. So I'll just get them. Um, and then I can paint, finish the painting the wall that's left and the ceiling. And if there's more paint left over, I can repaint a bit of the wall and the ceiling that I did in spring, so that's all nice and fresh and then we'll see what happens with the floor. Anyway, for me, now this is important. Here I've got to mark up all the load bearing uh, columns and uh, get some work done with that. Also, I'm gonna end the video here. I, I need to concentrate on this and make sure I mark everything up right. Um, probably when once I have everything marked up and start drilling or so I'll be recording but yeah I this will need my full attention um, thank you everyone for watching I hope you enjoyed this video and it wasn't too short um, and I hope to see you in the next one bye